Selective and Differential Media Setup. In this experiment, we investigate a selection of the selective and differential media available. The key to success with this experiment is good labeling, organization, concentration, and of course, good aseptic technique. Particularly as a large number of cultures are in use and cross-contamination will obscure results. Begin by labeling each of the six plates provided. Two or three cultures will be spread on each, so the plate must be divided into the correct number of sections and labeled with the cultures to be inoculated. Include your initials and the date on each plate also. The cultures are provided as an overnight broth. The Baird Parker or BP medium is pale yellowish and opaque and will be inoculated with Staphylococcus aureus and Astricia coli. Carefully and aseptically perform a single continuous streak of the broad cultures on the appropriate section of each agar. Take care to avoid encroaching on other sections. The Columbia Blood Agar, or CBA, is a rich red colour and will be inoculated with Streptococcus pyogenes, Estrichia coli and Enterococcus faecalis. The Eocene Methylene Blue Plate or EMB, is a brownish colour and will be inoculated with Estrichia coli, Pseudomonas aeruginosa and Staphylococcus aureus. The Membrane Laurel Sulphate Agar Medium, or MLSA, is a bright red colour and will be inoculated with Estrichia coli and Bacillus subtilis. The Manitol Salts Agar, or MSA, is pinkish red and will be inoculated with Staphylococcus aureus and Staphylococcus epidermidis. The McConkie Agar, or MC, is a deep red burgundy colour and will be inoculated with Estrichia coli, Pseudomonas aeruginosa and Staphylococcus aureus. Once complete, wrap and label the stack of inverted plates. 
These will be incubated at 37 degrees for 24 hours.